good morning. I did my workout this morning and I uploaded it for you. Take a look on YouTube. I promised and I did what I promised. Welcome to Ask Miss Millie. We have two questions this morning. The first one, how did you finish high school illiterate? That is a very good question. I asked that question to myself many, many times. Well, I think that if you have uh, parents that are inadequate, and my parents were, uh, my mother and father had 10 children. Uh, they got married very early uh, at the age of 18. Um, and they had a baby almost every year. I came from a very loving family. My parents, I believe, loved their children the way they raised us. I can tell that we came out all right, all of us, and they're proud of us. But I think that sometimes the illiteracy can stem from home training. Also in school, I think that reading out loud is important for the teacher to hear the student read. I don't remember ever reading out loud to my teacher. So that could have been one of the problems too. But I think the biggest problem is that my dyslexic wasn't discovered. And uh, I went through life with a very uh, fearful uh, problem in my, inside my head where my words would actually move on the page. So that, I think, caused a lot of it as well. And the other question we had today was, I am a freshman in college and I feel that I'm not reading adequately. What should I do? Well, I think that you should first find a mentor. Second, find a tutor. And third, discuss your inac inadequacy with your language teacher and let someone know that you trust that will make you feel comfortable. And I understand that it's embarrassing, but you shouldn't. Because I wished someone had told me when I was very, very young to tell somebody that I was seeing my words move. And I was frightened and I was nervous when it came to reading. So don't be nervous. You can beat this. You can conquer this. Don't be embarrassed. Tell someone. That's what I would do. You've made it to college and you could make it further. Tell somebody. Find some help. God bless you. Take care. See you next time on Ask Miss Millie.